Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And for today's video, I'm going to be planning out my social media December monthly view using colorful boxes and Christmas joy. As I was flipping through the sticker book, I noticed these number wreaths and I thought they were so adorable. And I think this is exactly where I want to start off with. I'm just gonna start by placing these right over the number. So let's see how it's going to look once everything is filled in. And I especially like it because it does match what's already on the page. I think it's gonna look very well and we're gonna work off of the reds and greens and possibly even golds. So let's just keep adding these. All right, there we go. How pretty does that look? I already love it so much. I feel like I can just stop right here and call it a day. It looks really good. And let's see. I wanted to go ahead and see if I start adding just a little bit of decoration. I don't want to add too much. Um... But let's see what we have. I think I saw these right here. And I thought that they were so pretty. So I think I am going to add this little cute jar. Okay, how pretty does that look? Um, let's see. I'm wondering if this Tis the Season will be way too big for this space right over here. Um... Let's see if we find anything else. I like this um, blue color that it has. Like it just brought in this blue color and I like that. Um, so these little ballerinas are way too cute. They do have that blue going on. And then these ones don't have the clear backing like the other ones do. Let's see if we can find anything else. Ooh, there's that blue color. I like that one. Hmm. These are just letters. And okay, so most of the decorations are going to be towards the front. Ooh, and there's that big wreath, Peace on Earth. That could kind of work too, but I feel like there's already too many wreaths on the page. So let's not. I want to see how this little ballerina looks right over here. She might be too big. But let's try it out. Okay, so that looks pretty. I don't know why, but I'm liking this blue color. So, um, let's see. Home for the Holidays. It has that blue. And I'm going to see if we can put this sticker right over her or possibly even the jar if I can just get it. Okay, there we go. And maybe something like this. Okay, that looks really pretty. And let's go ahead and bring in colorful boxes. And then we could go from there, see if we can keep adding any more decoration or we're just going to keep it functional. So I think I chose this one because it has that really bright um, red. So I think I'm going to start off with red. And this one, I'm going to place it down on Monday. And these are my mini vertical spreads. So I'm I think I'm just gonna do it maybe just down a little. Did I want to put it directly inside or even maybe off to the side a little bit? I think I like that. So I think I am. So there. So all these red ones are going to indicate my mini vertical spreads on Monday. Okay, so those are the red ones and then I also ended up switching. I was originally going to do my skinny classic spreads on Sunday. And that was for the month of November. But I think I only did that one time. And I ended up switching them over to Wednesday. 
So instead of adding them on Sunday, I'm going to add them on Wednesday. So let's look for some green ones now. Okay, so here we are. And I think I want to go with the lighter green ones just because the wreaths already have that dark green. And I think this lighter green is going to look way too cute. So um, let's just add them down for Wednesday. And I like the fact that I'm putting them off to the side. I think that is looking very pretty instead of putting it just completely inside of the box. I think this looks much better. So now we have the skinny classic all done. And then my Friday videos are my social media ones. And now that I see this page right here, I am noticing this blue color, which is gonna go very well with the blue that we've added to the page. So I think I'm going to add a blue one and I think this darker blue would be very nice. It matches her. So I'm just going to put these down and I am going to need to add some on Saturday. So that's why I'm putting them just a tiny bit more up. That way I have room to add them on Saturday too. So one more and I just noticed that these um, I ended up putting them down so I do need to move these up. Okay there we go and I think that now I'm just going to go back to a red color and I don't think we're going to have enough to add more of that dark red but at least we'll add some of this faded red. So just going to add them and I think they're going to just go down maybe like this. I think I'll touch the bottom of it and I'll overlap it onto Friday. Okay, so that does look good. So let's see if we wanted to add any more decorations. Um, I'm thinking I need something over here in this corner, but what could we add? I do see this little car right here with the Christmas tree on top. So let's see how it'll look. I need my tweezers. Oh my goodness, that's going to look way too adorable. <laughs> okay, there we go. I like that. And now that I'm looking at this box, I think it's kind of slanted. So I do want to fix this. Okay, <laughs> there we go. Much better. And I think this is looking so good and I don't want to add anything else. I think I'm pretty happy with the way it looks. So I do want to add it onto the disc. I am loving this blue that we added to the spread. I think it really breaks up the green and the reds. It looks so pretty. It's such a pretty color. And because she had this blue, I think it just ties everything together. It doesn't look out of place and I love it. These wreaths really caught my eye as soon as I was flipping through that sticker book. I usually don't do it so I thought it was a great idea to try it out and I do like the way that it looks and now we're all set. I know my Monday videos are my vertical layout. My Wednesday is my skinny classic. Fridays are my social media and Saturdays are my dashboard layout and even though I know that this is a set schedule I still like to write it down because really my monthly view um, helps me keep track of any additional videos that I happen to put out for the month and I usually go in with a little book like this and I'll add small little icons which would be these right here but because we added the wreaths I 
think if I end up adding any of these, it's going to look a little bit cluttered and I don't want that. So I may just go in with a mile liner and make a bullet point and just write it out instead of adding one of these icons because I don't want it to look too cluttered. So I may or may not use these, but my monthly view is mainly to track any additional videos that I do for the month and it just helps me see how many additional videos I did or didn't do as opposed to the previous months. So that's been working out great for me. Um, I love this system and as long as it keeps working, I think this is what I'm going to stick to. So if you like this video, please consider subscribing and don't forget to check me over on Instagram at Stephanie Happily Plants and I'll see you next time.